Hello guys, and this is my video about Ubuntu Mate on the Raspberry Pi 2. So, uh, first of all, I am gonna do some sort of announcement. Uh, on my channel I just uh, make a video, talk about the iOS, and sort of review it, and then that's the video. Now I'm gonna put some, some structure in my video. So first of all, I'm gonna review the menu speed, then the browser speed, then a text render speed, that's mostly LibreOffice, and then the looks. Now, of course, the looks are personal, because I think RiscOS is uglier than Ubuntu, and that uh, Windows IoT preview is pretty, well, pretty cool. Um, but the menu speed is pretty fair. Browser speed is, of course, not fair in things like the IoT preview of Windows 10. The text writer speed is also not fair. And RiscOS is like, well, browser speed, you know, it was made back in the 80s. Of the 90s, or was it the, the, the 20s? I don't know. <laughs> okay, sure. Applications. The menu is pretty fast. No lag, no no bugs or something. Uh, on the first boot it was kind of buggy, but that's, that's normal. <laughs> uh, the browser speed. I'll first set on the uh, system monitor. Look, this is what the system does. It does around 8% when in idle. That's not bad for us Pi. Uh, so let's start Firefox. Let's see how many seconds that takes. That took around a while. YouTube. Enter. Pretty fast. Mm, yeah. But it lags kind of. But you know, YouTube is a pretty heavy website. Uh, I always like the website of Tweakers, which is a Dutch uh, technology site. That site's always pretty fast loading and fast scrolling. I like that one. Uh, as you can see, this is what YouTube and the starting of Firefox did. This is, I think, around 50% of the core at average. See? Browsing this goes actually pretty good. Okay, quit the web browser. Then the text writer. So we still have the system monitor. Let that one cool down. Okay, text writer. LibreOffice. Of course, it was pre-installed. I didn't actually install an, uh, an extra app. Firefox was pre-installed. I had to run sudo apt get upgrade or update to get a new version, but you know, that was fine. Okay, LibreOffice works also awesomely fast. I think that Ubuntu is like, many people are like, yeah, well, I want to buy a Raspberry Pi and use it as an old PC. Well, um, there you go. It has a text writer, a browser, fast menu, cool looks. Oh, wait. That's what I didn't talk about yet. The looks. Of course. This looks awesome. This, looks am this is a standard background. You know how awesome this is? There's like a universe background. And then the menu, also pretty cool. The map. Like, map. The, the files. Oh. Open to them. Pretty beautiful. But I was talking about the usage as an old PC. Uh, most people find a normal PC like, well, what is a normal PC? Well, you can browse in it. Browse fast. So that's Ubuntu doesn't browse fast. That's, I think, the only uh, flaw. But um, make documents on it well that works uh needs to be beautiful works you need to be able to email on it works um so yeah i think this is a good operating system for the supply yeah well thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye